All right, guys, Good Boy 32 here. Check it out. So uh, went out to SHOT Show. Ran into some really cool people. <laughs> Among those was the guys out of there at uh, Palmetto State Armory. Now, they got a really cool firearm that's getting ready to come out. And uh, one of the things we were able to do was sit down and talk to one of the guys from Lead Star who was instrumental in the design of this bad boy. And he is going to give us all the details. So with that being said, I'm going to play this little clip here. There's a lot of background noise as a shot show, so uh, turn your stuff up so you can hear. Because when this guy comes out, one will be mine. Oh yeah, one will be mine. Here we go. Stay by. Hey guys, my name is Derek from Let's Our Arms. Um, we're here to talk a little bit about the PSA 5. I know it's a burning question on everybody's minds. Let's start building the PSA 5. The relationship is run by the same capital group, but we're also a real high engineering firm. Uh, we also do our own machining, you know, even CAD, CAM, machining, build own fixturing, and assembly here in Red Star. So our resume is four world championships, two world records, and a whole lot of other titles uh, in there, state championships, and so on. To control the cost of this PSA 5, we have to do it all in house. So that's where we come in at. We can take this gun from the start to finish, and you're going to get a much, much better product out of this. This gun is going to be a legitimate gun. Uh, some of the features on it, uh, excuse me why I unthread. So here we have the tri-lug adapter. But if you notice, I have 28 threads go right up to the front side. So now you can pop on a cross washer, then you can thread your favorite muzzle device on it, and direct thread your suppressor. You can put the tri-lug adapter back on it, and you can put the tri-lug adapter suppressor right on it. So that's a pretty cool feature, actually. Another quick thing here in the front is, We've got an A2 front side post, which is a really, really good feature. You don't have the fixed blade side anymore. So all of our elevation is controlled off the front side post. And I have in my pocket here. A little show and tell. A2 front side post. One of the other cool things about it is now you can put in the blitzkrieg components, chevron style, front side post. You can get a tritium dot with orange, you can get all orange chevron, you can get a complete tritium chevron. It's a pretty cool feature to have actually. You no longer have to paint up the front side post with the orange paint. <laughs> The other nice thing about having an AQ front side post is, so you control the elevation, so in the back, you no longer have to use the dial for it to me. Uh, that's worth its weight in gold to me. It is just a click adjustment, we have a pistol notch, so it's on detents, you click it, you can change the sight, you can control uh, windage, loosen the screw, adjust it with windage screw, Lock it back down. Once again, no dial putter tool. If you really, and I don't know why you want to, but if you ever want to change it back to the standard um, dial putter style drum, you can do that. It fits right on the receivers. Pick a teeny rail. No more claw mount tire chain up the receiver. No more extra things to purchase. It's welded right onto the receiver. Which allows you to see right through, use your iron sights, use your dot. Pretty cool. SP Tactical uh, brace. We have a Magpul grip and a Magpul ambidextrous safety. That will come standard. Yeah, I know. Everybody's burning question. Yes, it does have a paddle bag release and then a button on the side, but it does have the paddle bag release. It's going to be right in the gun as it comes. The trigger, we're partnering with CMC Triggers, and we're going to make a better, 
trigger to go in this. Uh, I've never been a fan of the MB5 triggers, so we're going to solve that problem. You know, come with a Magpul hand guard. Uh, and the one thing important to note here is we're not changing the operating system. That operating system has worked really, really well for a very long time, very proven. We're leaving the operating system just like it is. And the whole head gear is full auto rated. It's already going to have tungsten. If you ever wanted to switch out, it's got a shelf on it, and you wanted to switch out, you can put your, your trigger packs, you put an MP5 trigger pack right back in it. We're not changing any of that. It's going to why, but or if you want to put your full auto trigger pack in it, you can do that. You have to modify it for the, uh, the shelf and stuff, but you can put your full auto trigger pack back in it. The grip is going to be standard. And you're going to be able to do an HK slap. <laughs> So, I know the big burning questions, when's it going to be available? 2020. It is legitimately coming in 2020. It's happening. So get ready. Next question, price. Everybody wants to know that one too. The truth of the matter is, we're still machining on parts. We don't have all the true costs. I know gut field, you're going to be very, very happy. It's going to be better than the closest competitor, and you're going to have a whole lot more features uh, associated with it. And we're also going to have a classic version that's going to come out, where it will not have a Picatinny rail, and it'll have the SP Tactical kind of A2 kind of folding kind of brace uh, to go along with it. Perfect. Thank you. Thanks. All right, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed that uh, as much as I did, and I can't wait to see when this thing does come out. That price point for such an amazing firearm is going to be amazing. If it's built anything like that AKV, I know it's going to be great. So anyway, when they do come out, hopefully I'll be uh, getting one of those bad boys so uh, we can throw some rounds downrange and uh, beat the hell out of it. But with that being said, we always end it like this. God bless America. God bless those men and women in uniform who defend our Constitution as it was written by our founding fathers. Go to War 32. I'm out.